Austin, you are loyal, generous, kind-hearted, and never take life too seriously, unless Star Wars or Fast Jets are involved, <laughs> in which case that's some pretty serious stuff. <laughs> Claudia, I love that you challenge me to be an honest, caring, and hardworking man through your own motivation, loyalty, and dedication. And most importantly, I love that you've entrusted me with your whole heart and how you give me your unconditional love every single day. I met Claudia in the seventh grade when we were partnered up to work on a science project together. And to be honest with you, I really don't remember our friendship forming. I just remember our instant connection and immediately knowing, even as a 12-year-old, that we were best friends and that the friendship we shared was truly rare and would last a lifetime. There's not many people that you can spend literally every day with for the past 13 years, but I truly don't know what I would have done if I didn't have Claude there with me every step of the way. Her honest, genuine, and caring personality is a rare find. Thank you for being the voice of reason when my wild side takes over. Thank you for making me your weird vegetarian dinners, which I always act like I don't want, but I really end up always liking. Thank you for the countless walks and cocktails shared when we talk for hours on end. Thank you for always listening when I come to you with anything and everything. Thank you for always loving me for who I am. And thank you for being the sister I've never had and the best friend I've always needed. You're truly irreplaceable, Claude, and I'm so blessed to have you in my life. My name is Nick. I am Austin's younger brother. My name is Jackson, uh, also a younger brother. <laughs> We're super glad Austin chose Jackson and myself to be the best men. He's finally admitted that we are better than he is. So, <laughs> it's not every day that you can find someone that you truly fall in love with and can spend the rest of your life with. For Austin, lucky enough that happened 25 years ago when I came into his life. <laughs> So, leading up to this event, I, you know, thought about how can I talk about Austin in one word. The one word that came to my mind was passionate. Passionate in, in everything he did, who he loved, his family, sports, academics. To be honest, if I had anyone to pick as a role model, I would pick Austin. Uh, he's been there for me uh, countless times with anything I could go to him. Uh, I've, I've shed tears as I talk to Austin, and he's always been there for me, and he always will be, and I know that. So, thank you. I'd like to welcome everybody, friends, family. It's been awesome. The weather held off. So um, I just like to say, what a freaking couple, huh? I know she's
has always dreamed of this day, and I hope it's as special as it was for me, and it's going to be. So it's special for Austin and his family. So I'd just like to say again, thanks and welcome, and let's have a good time tonight, huh? Today is your natural state of being. These other qualities are not easily to come by. They're not a destination, but they're a part of the journey. Marriage is a give and take between two personalities and emerging of two sets of talents and abilities, which do not diminish who you are, but they are to enhance who you are as a couple. We lit up with the sunrise. It's my heartbeat running wild. Austin, I promise to cherish you always and to love you unconditionally forever. I vow to support you on the dark days and celebrate with you on the best ones. I'm on your team forever and I can't wait to see where this love takes us and this life. I love you. We lit up with the sunrise. Gets my heartbeat running wild. Claudia, I promise to hold and protect you from anything that makes you feel unsafe or unwanted. I promise to always listen when you feel like the rest of the world is ignoring you. I promise to give you my entire heart and all of my love through whatever we may face as husband and wife. And I promise to prove all my words through my actions. And in my actions, I'll prove that having you as my wife is my greatest priority. And we'll dream, dream out loud, take our chance. And by the authority invested in me by the Constitution and laws of this state, it is my honor now to pronounce you husband and wife. Austin, let me kiss your bride. We will go. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure and honor to introduce to you the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Austin Orville. Yours here right now. I just want to thank both of you for uh, sealing the deal on me never getting married because I will never find anything as true and pure as your guys' love, and I know that. So uh, on that note, if everybody will raise their glass, propose a toast uh, to family, a friend, and now my sister Claudia and Austin, I love you both. Cheers.
Claudia and Austin, you two are the best versions of yourself when you're together. Words can't describe the joy that I have being here today to celebrate the start of the rest of your lives together. I love you both so much, and we all wish you many happy, incredible years. If everybody can raise their glasses to the newlyweds and the couple of the decade, Claudia and Austin.